Hey, how is going everyone? My name is Nort, and today I'm going to be discussing quite an interesting topic which has just popped up in the GTA community. Now, the information I'm going to be using does actually develop quite a good case into what I'm going to be discussing about, and I wouldn't be making this video unless I honestly believed the case I'm going to show you guys. So before I get into this video, I would just like to say a brief mention to Mr. Boss for the win. I actually checked out something he did similar to this. If you want to go and check out his video version of it, I'll leave a link to it down in the description below. Anyway, without wasting any more time, let's get into the information and let me present to you guys the case I have for you about Nico Bellic returning to Grand Theft Auto V. So if you guys don't know who the voice actor of Nico Bellic is, his name is Michael Hollick. And Michael Hollick actually left Rockstar Games after he had a dispute over the amount of money he was paid for voice acting for Nico Bellic around eight years or so ago. And ever since, there have been rumors about him joining back and, and working with with Rockstar Games again and whether he would be interested in doing that. Now unfortunately there's been not much word on this until just the other day when someone came across his YouTube channel and on his channel you can see very personal vlogs of things inside his life. You can also see Dorito commercials and many other things including this channel description which you can see in the about section of his page in which it says this is the official YouTube channel of the guy behind the voice of Grand Theft Auto 4 and Grand Theft Auto 5. Nico Bellic, Michael Hollick, husband, father of Maxwell Hollick and Eva Hollick and married to actress Angelia Tsai. Now looking at his page and his uploads, I am pretty much persuaded already that this is his personal YouTube channel. He uploads adverts he's done, he's uploaded personal vlogs and also if you looked into the liked videos, you will see a hidden gem. And it's actually a video from Mr. Boss for the Win who uploaded Nico's updated Life Invader page about Nico Bellic being alive in Grand Theft Auto V. Now this video was uploaded a year ago, yet he's just liked it on his YouTube channel and you you can see this for yourself if you look into this guy's liked videos as well, which brings on even more speculation that he might be making a return to Grand Theft Auto V. Now, someone else also tweeted me this image of the GTA works in which it shows what he featured in in the Grand Theft Auto series, and it shows Grand Theft Auto IV, The Lost and Damned, The Ballad of Gay Tony, and Grand Theft Auto V, Nico Bellic 2013, Collector's Edition DLC only. Now, I don't want you guys to get too hyped up about the last bit of evidence I just showed you guys that could be something completely different either way it can help or it can just not do anything in this case regardless I think I've got enough information to persuade myself that we could be seeing the return of Nico Bellic in Grand Theft Auto 5 in a story mode update the reason why I don't want to go off the last bit of information is because it could be in the character selection menu in which when you choose your character you can choose Nico Bellic as your father which is why I do not want to go all the way on that bit of information but once again it could be something else related to this case. Now let's take a look at a few Easter eggs. Now I'm sure loads of you guys are familiar with this one Easter egg. It is the Nico Bellic Life Invader page. You can view this if you take a look just outside of Michael's house and if you look at what Jimmy is viewing on the laptop, it is Nico Bellic's Life Invader page. Now this page is very interesting and these things have all been marked out so you can see different things on this page which are relevant to this Easter egg. For example, Nico Bellic posted a photo in Chinatown. He's been stalking Burger Shot seven times and he's got 24 friends. And you can also see that he posted this status update saying, Happy Birthday Roman. Nico Bellic is still alive. He's got a Life Invader page and there are a variety of Easter eggs regarding Nico Bellic in Grand Theft Auto V and it would come as no surprise to see him return into this game if he were to return in a future update. Now there's been loads of speculation as to whether Nico Bellic could return and after looking in the game files, I say this so many times, there are a variety of references to do with Grand Theft Auto 4 and Liberty City making a return into Grand Theft Auto 5, including this one photo taken straight out of the game files, which has the Rockstar Games logo over a backdrop of Liberty City. So once again, I think there's going to be something to do with Nico Bellic returning. I want to know your thoughts down in the comments section below. What do you think about this? And if you did find this video helpful, then please don't leave without clicking that like button. And if you are new here, I do recommend you click that subscribe button as well, as you'll never miss out on any more Grand Theft Auto 5 content every single day. Feel free to let me know your thoughts and questions down in the comments, and I will see you guys next time.